What up, YouTube? I'm Paul Jets. How you guys doing? I uh, just got a little bit of uh, mail, mail stuff to get to. Today is the uh, MLB trade deadline. Um, I'm not holding my breath for the Mets to do anything. They keep, they're keep they always in talks, but they never seem to pull any deals off. Um, I mean, there are one game over 500. They're like five or six games out of the wild card. So they could. They are still alive for the playoffs, but they don't seem like they're too too uh, too aggressive right now to make a move to make the team better. So uh, it might be another wasted Mets season for me. You know, I should be used to it by now, but um, I'm gonna pretty soon I'm gonna be counting down the days till the Jets season starts because it's just seems like every year the Mets they're good enough to make you excited, but they're never good enough to actually take that next step. So uh, I'll just have to. I guess I'll have to just watch it, wait for another year, <laughs> hope for the best. But, uh, yeah, I'm super psyched for the Jets, though, this season. They got the Hard Knocks coming up. I ordered HBO just basically just so I could watch Hard Knocks when it starts uh, August 11th, so I'm psyched about that. But, uh, and, uh, you know, very excited for that season. Any any kind of football to start. I've been, it's been unbelievable how bad I want to see football. Like, I was watching high school football the other day on TV because that's how bad I wanted to just see football. I don't even care what kind. And I hate high school football. I played high school football. I do not. I have no zero interest in watching a bunch of 17, 16, 17-year-old kids play football. I have zero interest. But it was football, and I had to friggin' watch it. It was. It just looked so like so much fun. But and uh, first preseason game starts August 8th. So you better be watching that. I can't wait for it. NFL football. Is what I want to see. Really. But anyway, on to the mail. Just as usual, just a bunch of random stuff. Um. Uh, this is for trade. I got this um, just in a trade on uh, Beckett. It's an 09 Rookies and Stars Longevity. Dress for success. No Sean Moreno. Rookie jersey. That is out of 100. That is for trade. If anyone's interested. Pick this up. Also a trade off Beckett. It's just a card for my Mets slash Mike Piazza PC. I, ha I collect Mets. Any Mets cards in Mets uniform. Um, but I also have like a side collection of just Mike Piazza since he's one of my favorite players growing up. Um, this is a 2005 um, Clear Authentics Hot Ticket Mike Piazza jersey card. There's some nice seams and stuff on this jersey. You might be able to see it. But yeah, that's PC. Next package. It's another trade off Beckett. This is a card for my. Uh, this is actually a pretty cool card. Any Yankees fans out there might like this too. It's um, I, I found, found this card. I thought it looked pretty cool. It's a um, 2003 Upper Deck MVP base to base. It's a dual base card. Check this out. Two pieces of base. Roger Clemens, Mike Piazza. And uh, it says on the back here, it says, You received a Roger Clemens and Mike Piazza game used base trading card from Upper Deck Company. On the front of this card is an authentic pieces of bases used in an official Major League game at Shea Stadium during the 2000 World Series. That's pretty sick. Pieces of the bases that they used during the Subway Series when the Mets paid the Yankees. So I thought that card was really sick. It only books 20 bucks. I figured, you know, these are historic pieces of bases right here. World Series pieces of bases. I thought it would book for more than that. I didn't have to trade much to get it. That, that card's really cool, being a big Mets fan. So, I mean, even though they lost that World Series, it's still a pretty cool card. Um, so another trade, um, some more trade bait. 2009 Donner's Threads Ben Roethlisberger jersey. Numbered out of 100. Raplesberger, whatever you want to call him. That card is for trade. And this uh, is for PC. Uh, 06 Topps Finest. DeBrickishaw Ferguson X Fractor Rookie Auto. Numbered out of 250. He's really turned into like one of the best left tackles in the league. When he first got drafted, um, first few years, they thought it was a little bit of disappointment. He's turned into one of the best uh, left tackles in the league. He just signed a contract contract extension with the Jets, so expecting big more big things from DeBrick. And then um here's just two PC cards I traded for. Um, 08 SPX winning materials Jose Reyes jersey with a pinstripe that is numbered out of 125 and this card is really nice I really like this card 
2008 SP Authentic Dustin Keller Rookie Patch Auto. Numbered out of 999. Really sick card for the Jets PC. Two color, not not a bad patch at all. So that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm trying to get a box in here. Uh, maybe to bust for you guys pretty soon, hopefully. So keep a look out for that. Um, that's about it, guys. Have a great weekend, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.